What is a 900 volt drive system and how will it affect EVs going forward? Electric cars are traveling into the mainstream as more and more motorists choose pure electric power, and let's be honest. Even the most ardent EV advocate admits that range anxiety, the persistent fear of running out of fuel, remains a serious concern. The drive system is a complex network of components that could be even more efficient, and charging times can seem endless compared to quick stops at the gas station. Chinese electric vehicle manufacturer Nao has made significant progress toward addressing one of these challenges by announcing the world's first mass-produced 900-volt drive system. While this may seem like a technical detail only engineers care about, trust us when we say it's a game-changer. We are about to explore the world of greater voltages and faster charging, so fasten your seatbelt. Before we proceed, be sure to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell notification icon in order to stay connected. You can support for free by sharing our content to a wider audience and don't forget to drop your thoughts and opinion in the comments section below. Moving forward, an automobile's drive system which harnesses the engine's initial impulse is its vital component. Acceleration is controlled smoothly and effectively by the transmission, which manages the power transfer from the engine to the wheels. The drivetrain, a sophisticated system of shafts and gears, transfers power from the transmission to the wheels like a well-oiled machine. The axles and drive shaft differential contribute to turning the engine's rumble into forward motion. The drive system is a potent mix of the drivetrain and engine that turns an automobile from a parked piece of machinery into a roaring beast prepared to take on the road. They debuted a mass-produced version of their next-generation, extremely powerful 900-volt electric drive system EDS. On March 27, in addition to announcing that they had achieved a significant milestone by constructing their 1 millionth EDS, Here's why this is revolutionary for NEO and the EV market at large. The Thunder EDS prioritizes efficiency in expanding the interior space of your vehicle. The electric motors in the front and rear axles of NEO have been remarkably reduced in weight and shortened by 280 mm. Consider this. A lighter vehicle requires less energy to move, extending its range and saving you money on gas. Additionally, a smaller vehicle allows for greater interior space, allowing you to stretch out and enjoy the ride. This is possible because the electric motors are lighter and smaller. With a permit magnet synchronous motor on the rear axle that weighs only 79 kilograms, lighter than most gym bags, and a power density of 4.3 cal per cag, imagine Neo freeing up valuable interior space inside the vehicle. The higher the power density, which is equivalent to the amount of muscle packed into a small area, the more efficient the motor. Nao asserts that their front-mounted asynchronous motor, or ASM, has the highest power density of any asynchronous electric motor in the world, at 2.6 cal per keg. If you can try it, it's fairly astounding, but how can they get even more power out of these lightweight motors? Nao's engineers were able to increase the peak continuous output by 30%, which translates to a smoother, more powerful driving experience without sacrificing efficiency. The secret sauce is a redesigned cooling system that keeps the motors cool even when they're working hard. An overheated motor cannot handle more power. Referring to effectiveness, Neo is concentrating on improving the system's overall intelligence in addition to reducing the size of objects. The new power electronics that control the ASM and PSM rely on silicon carbide semiconductors, which can be compared to extremely effective traffic cops for electricity. These semiconductors manage power flow with little loss, and best of all, they are built to last for over 300,000 power cycles, which essentially means your car will continue to run strong for many years to come. NAO has also included a powerful engine. The upcoming NAO ET9 will be the first vehicle to use the Thunder EDS and has some amazing features. With a peak power output of 340 kilowatts, the ET9's rear axle houses the first ever 92025 VW pin synchronous permanent magnet electric motor in history. That's a lot of power. So what does all of this imply for you, the EV enthusiast? Thunder EDS from Mio is laying the foundation for lighter, more capacious EVs with strong, efficient motors in the future. This could result in greater range, faster acceleration, and a more comfortable driving experience overall. The Thunder EDS is packed with tons of other amazing technology that makes it a game-changer. The electric motors themselves are seriously impressive, but that's not all. The Thunder EDS uses a unique type of silicon carbide power module that can withstand high voltages, we're talking about 1200 volts, and is incredibly dense, 
packing a whooping 1315 kilowatts of power per liter. Imagine packing all that power into such a small space, that takes some serious engineering. Last but certainly not least, the Thunder EDS features a redesigned liquid cooling system. This might sound a bit boring, but trust us, it's important as mentioned. This new system keeps the motor nice and cool even when it's working hard. Imagine continuous wave winding as a special way of wrapping the wires inside the motor. This cool tech lets the motor deliver a hopping 86% of its full power even at lower speeds. Guess what a cooler motor means more power? In fact, the updated liquid cooling system increases the motor's peak continuous power by 30%, which benefits both efficiency and performance. Let's talk about the Neo ET9. This beast, which is a hopping 5.33 meters long and has plenty of space for both passengers and cargo, is available for pre-order right now and deliveries will begin in the first quarter of 2025. The price tag starts at about 800,000 W, which is equivalent to 100,000 euros or $112,000, so get ready to invest in some serious electric luxury. This is what really sets the ET9 apart. With a 120 kilowatts hour battery made with NIO's own round cells, the ET9 is built on the brand new 900 platform. These aren't your average batteries though, and they pack a serious punch with an energy density of 292 watt hours per kilogram, which means they can store a lot of energy in a relatively small package. Now let's talk about charging. Forget about taking hours to do it. When connected to a charging station, the ET9 can be charged at an astounding 5C rate or 6600 kilowatt hours, which means that in only 5 minutes you can add enough juice to the device to cover 255 kilometers according to CLUT regulations. Talk about a brief intermission, large cylindrical battery cells and the company's first 5 nanometer autograde chip are among the more than 100 NIO full stack technologies integrated into the ET9. With its roomy interior, cutting-edge technology, and remarkable performance capabilities, the ET9, which is priced at 800,000 W, is positioned as a formidable rival to premium automakers like Porsche, BMW, and Mercedes-Benz. Pre-orders for the vehicle have begun in China. The NIO ET9 offers customers an attractive option in the luxury EV class, marking a significant advancement in the electric vehicle market. And that concludes this chapter. You can support for free by sharing our content to a wider audience and don't forget to drop your thoughts in the comments section below. Also, kindly remember to like, subscribe, share, and turn on the bell notification icon in order to stay connected. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.